it's here it's here it's here i can't believe it i can't believe it i can't believe it so this is the super summer swap box that i got this just got in the mail to me yesterday i have been anxiously anxiously waiting to open it and i've held off because my kids um are home it's the weekend and um but my daughter's asleep my son is playing with his grandfather and my husband's downstairs just monitoring things so if you don't know, today is the big day. Everybody on ColorTube that participated in the Super Summer Swap is opening their box. I want to thank Danielle, Danny Buttons, who so kindly put this together and invited me to join. It was a group of eight of us um, who were all kind of anonymously assigned to each other to do a like coloring themed box for the summer to swap with each other. So there were a couple of rules. There were eight people total. We had a spending limit. You had to include in the box one item off of that person's wish list and one non-wish list item, or I guess coloring book. And then there had to be one item related to summer. So you will find out, stay tuned at the end of this video, who it was that I, um, um, who it was that I sent my box to. And I'm so excited because I had a ton, a ton of fun. It took me about three weeks to get the things that I needed to include in their box. So I will reveal that at the end of this video so that you know to go watch that person's video and see what it is that they received. But when I got this box in the mail, and I think I had a pretty good guess at who this person was, but it was kind of funny. I had been messaging Danielle back and forth. Um, we had to, she was helping coordinate things. So we were giving her shipping information and stuff. And she kept talking about how she was so excited for her person to get her package. And I was just like, oh yeah, that's great, it's great, it's great. When I saw this I knew exactly who this was from <laughs> um these citruses on the front of the box um were an absolute giveaway there's some on the back too but it has our mailing information so I'm not gonna flip it over but I knew that this had to be the Danielle Danny Buttons got assigned to me which I'm super thrilled about she's huge into citrus and loves citrus and so um when I got this box I was like there's no way is it really her is it really her and she got assigned to me and I'm so 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 excited so we're gonna open this on camera today I want to show you all of the cool things that I got um so that you can kind of join in the fun with me it is a really weird time of day and the sun is kind of going down so there's a little bit of a glare but I don't care because I want to open this <laughs> so bad so bad so let's get into this sucker oh the pull all oh, the really tacky glue off of here muscles Lauren muscles Ugh. oh my gosh 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 you can't tell look guys look oh can you see all that all that goody 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 stuff in there and it's all individually wrapped of course it is so I'm gonna set this down next to me I'm gonna take out one thing at a time Oh, oh, wait, there's there an order? Let's see here. There might be an order to this. 36? Or is that 3B, 3A? Maybe 3A, 3B. A banana. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. <laughs> Danielle! This is so cute. Pineapple. Everything has something painted on it. Okay. And then this. A book that was on your wish list, a book that wasn't. Okay, so we're going to set all of this out. This is super cute. I'm so excited. This looks amazing. Oh, gosh. This is so cute. Okay. So, and then there is... There is a card. Oh, gift receipts just in case. Okay, so let me just open this. I'm just gonna open this. Well, no, I'll wait. I'll wait to open this. I'll wait to open that because I'm just gonna go ahead and get into it. So this is 3A and 3B. So I'm going to maybe set that stuff aside and let's go ahead and look. Those are books. Let's go ahead and just look at this stuff here. We're gonna start with the pineapple. My husband works in hospitality, so a pineapple is always just a way to say welcome. So we're gonna start with this real quick. Da, 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 da. What could it be? What could it be? 12 yummy scents. Oh, cute! 12 scented glitter gel pens. These are called Yummy Yummies. And on the back here are all of the different um, 
different scents that they are. Cherry, orange, banana, lime, apple, blueberry, raspberry, grape, strawberry, watermelon, coconut, and pineapple. So cute for summer. Oh, I'm going to love that. I'm going to love that. I, I have some gel pens, but I kind of keep like my go-to next to me. This is going to be really fun. And so I definitely have to color something with this. Awesome. 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 Okay. Let's start next with the banana. Let's see here. Banana. Banana. Is this a game? <gasps> oh, point salad. So cute. I have seen this game. We were actually just talking about this game. We do not have this, um, but we have been talking about getting it. So this is a really, really cool game. Danielle knows that I love board games. We collect board games at my house. Um, and so I haven't played this yet, but my husband was just talking about this and was just talking about how great of a game this is. So, um, this, I will definitely have to check out and play and keep you guys updated on it. My husband's going to be really thrilled about this. This will be so much fun. Thank you so much. That is awesome. And then, let's see, next is the cherries. Cherries are my favorite. When I, um, like anything like candy and stuff, I really like cherry flavored things cherry, strawberry. I also really like lemon and citrus flavored candies and things as oil. Ooh. Ooh. That is a super cute bag. I love the gold and the pink. That's adorable. That's, oh my gosh, there's like a ton of stuff in here. What is this? Lonnie Blueberry refresh, um, Replenishing Facial Mask with Blueberry Extract Replenishes and Refreshes the Skin. Ooh, I love face masks. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, and some nail polish. I just got my nails done today, but I love pink nail polish. Danielle and I also have, um, we swap stories a lot about nail polish. We both love Hollow Taco. Um, and so actually she came out with a new line, I think just yesterday. And so it was kind of like neon inspired, but honestly, this like magenta is legitimately, um, one of my absolute favorite colors. So this reminds me of magenta. Um, um, I actually have my magenta Sharpie that I use all the time right here. This looks very, very close. So that is fantastic and pink. And I love, love, love pink. This is a great like um, wearable pink. This is called Watermelon Felon. And this one is Pep Plum. So cute. I will definitely use these. Those are awesome. Thank you so much. And then there's more. This is Peep, um, Peep the Color Names. And then there's these. Oh, look at these. I think she meant peep the color names at the, um, at the nail polishes. So yeah, watermelon felon and peplum are the two names, which are super cute. Love that. And then these, which are like little tiny, they almost look like confetti. Hold on. I'm gonna have to zoom you guys in so you can see this. So if I put this on the back of here, it's like little conf confettis. Like they're in these tiny, cute little glass jars, but they're like little confettis. Like, I guess you could put them on like a coloring page. Um, that is way, way cute. So there, there's this one, which is like little kiwis. She got me this one, which is little apples. And then this one, which is little grapes. That is so cute. I'm going to have to find a way. I actually think I know exactly how I'm going to use these on a coloring page. These are adorable. Love, love, love those. Thank you so much. That is so much fun. Okay. I'm going to save the coloring books for last. I'm going to save those for last. We're going to go for this. This is 3A and 3B, I think is what that is. So let's look at the watermelon. Trying to make sure I'm still recording. I'm so nervous because it's only like you get only one take on this. Oh, they are fruit-shaped ice cubes. Oh my gosh. My kids are going to have a blast with these. Like, can you imagine just putting these in some, um, like a glass of lemonade or iced tea or something? Oh, that is so cute. That is so cute. 
actually, even Danielle, you don't even realize this, that my, you know, my daughter is kind of teething and stuff too. So this is almost perfect for her. I can put these in the, um, they might be a little bit small, might be a little bit small for her, but as she gets a little bit older and stuff too, um, some of those things on ice would be really, really good, but that's so cute in a little cup. Oh, and maybe this is what you're supposed to use it with. This one has an apple on it. This is probably what you're supposed to drink it with. Because this feels to me like... Oh, no. Oh, it's some bubbles. Oh, so cute. Bubbles are big in my household. They do remind me a ton of summer. Um because we have, we actually have a bubble machine at my house, um, that we used with my son and we haven't pulled out the bubbles yet, but, um, I think this will be a ton of fun for summer. And, um, my daughter, her first word, she actually, um, just spoke her first word a couple of, um, weeks ago. Her first word was bubble. So how appropriate to have some bubbles. That is so much fun. We will definitely use those. Definitely enjoy those. Bubbles are a really, really big deal in my household. Okay, book that was on my wish list. It has a little peach on it. Danielle, you are so talented. I could not have colored <laughs> or painted this stuff like you have. So book that was on my wish list. Let's take a peek at this one here. Oh, it's a Deborah Muller book. I know, I can tell from the backside. Oh, fun. This one is called Summertime Fun. This is my very first Deborah Muller book. I really have enjoyed her art. And um, um, so I put some of her books on my wish list that I've seen people kind of flip through. And um, yeah, so we can take a little peek at some of the pages here. Oh, cute. I'm excited. I like her style. Um, I like that there's not like a huge ton of background. The pictures are framed. I love the way that she does her hair. And they're just, I feel like you can just throw some bright, pretty colors in here. And I think it would look awesome. So I'm super excited about this. I will definitely be coloring a page out of this this month. This is so cute. Oh, like a little 4th of July. That's cute. And kayaking. This is already making, this is way making me think of summer, giving me big time summer vibes. Oh yeah, watermelon and stuff. Yeah, we used to um, go to my aunt's house for the 4th of July and we always had watermelon and we would put salt on it. It actually makes the watermelon really sweet. And so um, watermelon and salt are definitely a memory of for me of summer. This is really, really cute. Seems like a lot of images. Oh, and the tire swing. So yeah, I'm, oh, this is awesome. <gasps> Lemonade! Danielle, your scavenger hunt. <laughs> your scavenger hunt. Um, if you guys saw my scavenger hunt video, you will realize I was a major, major struggle when it came to finding lemonade. I searched through all of my books. I could not find a single book that clearly had something lemonade. This will be my redemption. Clearly, this is a lemonade stand. There is lemonade. There's a lemon there. There is a piece of citrus right there. So definitely lemonade. Are these all unique images? These, I haven't seen a repeat yet. She must do all unique images in her books. Is that the cover image? Yeah, that's the cover image there. Very, very cute. Feeding the seagulls. Very cute. Oh, I'm super excited about this. The only Deborah Muller books, I, I take that back. I do have some Deborah Muller books I have for color by number books, the Zen Doodle color by number books. But I mean, they're, I think like pets and like stained glass or something. I don't have any that are um, of this style. Yeah, they're all unique images. None of these are repeats. Oh yeah, being out back grilling. Yeah, with like the lightning bugs. Oh yeah. This just brings back a ton of summer memories for me just like that. So yeah, that's a ton of images too. It's got to be probably close to 25 to 30 images maybe um, in that book. So yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for this. This is awesome. All right. And then secondly, a book that was not on my wish list, which has some cute grapes here. Let's take a look. Oh, 
I actually think I know what this is and I have a funny story about it. Okay, let's look here. I kind of saw the pattern on the front. I was like, I think I know what this is. Yes. <laughs> okay. I have a very funny story about this book. Okay. So this is the Jade Summer adult coloring book with summer. So this is all summer themed images. It's really, really cute. Um, so, okay. So funny story about this book as I kind of flip through this again, Jade Summer single sided pages. Um, really cute. This kind of reminds me of, um, Camille Angelkova's, um, miniatures book in a way, cause it's kind of got that just, um, you know, a whole bunch of images that are kind of the theme of that particular season, but they're really, really cute. Um, okay. So funny story about this book and, and Danielle doesn't actually know this yet. And this is a perfect segue, um, because it's the last thing that I have to open is that the person that I, um, just gifted my box to, she actually got this book in her box. <laughs> Um, it was on her wish list. And so I got that as her wish list item. And um, um, so that's hysterical to me. And so actually when I saw it, I was like, oh, this is a really cute book. I didn't even know this book existed. So I don't know how old this book is. Do we have a, um, it doesn't say when it came. Oh yeah, 2020. So it came out last summer, I guess. Um, but yeah, my person had this book on their wish list. Um, which I thought was really cute and um, I was tempted to add it to mine because I kind of flipped through it and I was like oh that's really fun and interesting so yeah lots of really really cute summer images and flowers I can definitely see using my like distress inks and stuff here and even more funny I don't know if Danielle knows this does she know this is that I was doing Jade Summer June for my hashtag for the month of June. Danielle, are you sneaky? Did you pay attention? Or was this just total coincidence? I'm very interested to know. Also, that could also maybe be lemonade. Okay, and then I think we repeat. Jade Summer usually has a kind of like first and second copy um, of their pages, which is great too. So yeah, this is awesome. Let's put everything back just so you can see all of the amazing, wonderful things that I got from the amazing Danielle, Danny Buttons. And then I am going to reveal to you who my person was so that you can go and watch her videos. So here we go. Look at all the fun. I'm trying to figure out where to put everything. Look at all this fun stuff that I got. Oh, this is so much fun. I love this. Isn't that great? You can get everything in frame. You can see everything. So first of all, thank you, thank you, thank you so much to Danielle. This was amazing. This was so much fun. So cool. So neat to just get a couple of fun summery things um, and get some cool coloring stuff and non-coloring stuff and just fun summer items. So thank you so much for including me in this. Um, I am going to reveal to you the person that I gifted my box to is the amazing and wonderful Christy from Crafting with Christy. I will link her information down below. Go check out her channel. She should be posting a video today of her unboxing all of her goodies and stuff for me. I can't wait for you to see all of the things that I put together for her. It was quite the amazing trip um, to multiple places that I made to do so. And I think she's going to love it. So um, go on and head out to her channel. Um, you definitely already know one thing that's going to be in her box. And um, I look forward to seeing you all again soon. Thank you so much. Have a beautiful rest of your week. Bye.